Hi everyone, you are welcome to Maths Explorer. How to solve this nice explanation and algebra math problem, which is a square minus b square is equal to 65, where the condition is given that a minus b must be less than or equal to a plus b. So here we will try to find the value of a and b. Now first of all we will write solution. Now after the solution we will write the problem here in the solution. So the problem is a square minus b square is equal to 65. Now first of all we will factorize the left hand side. This is a famous algebraic identity a square minus b square. So here we will use this one algebraic identity a square minus b square is equal to a minus b times a plus b. So using this identity here in the left hand side of this equation, this equation will become now we will write this side of this expression. So this will become a minus b times a plus b is equal to 65. Now my dears look it to the left hand side. Here is the product of two expressions. So for these two expressions here we will factorize this number to the product of two numbers. So for that first of all we will find those factors of 65 whose product is 65. So this numbers are we can write 1 times 65 as 65 we can also write 65 times 1 is 65 no 65 is also equal to 13 times 5 no it is also equal to 5 times 13 so these are the possible numbers whose product are 65 and factors of 65. Now from here we will take those pair of numbers, only those numbers which follow the condition which is given in the question, this one, where a minus b is less than a plus b. So look into the first pair, this can follow it because if we take a minus b is equal to 1 and a plus b is equal to 65, so the condition is true. So this can follow, this cannot follow because here if we take a minus b is equal to this number and a plus b is equal to this number, so it cannot follow the above condition. It can also not follow the above condition and it can also follow the above condition. So here we will compare these two expressions with this pair of number and this pair of number. So here we have two possible conditions. The first condition is a minus b times a plus b is equal to we will replace 65 with this pair of number 1 times 65 now the second condition is a minus b times a plus b we will replace 65 with this pair of numbers 5 times 13 now we will solve these two conditions separately now first of all we will solve this one equation and this one case now here we will compare this first expression with the first one number and the second expression with the second one number so from here we will get two equations a minus b is equal to 1 and a plus b is equal to 65. Now how can get the value of a and b from these two equations? So we will add these two equations to find the value of a and b. Now by addition this minus b and this plus b will be cancelled and a plus a is 2a is equal to 1 plus 65 is 66 
now we will divide both side by 2 this 2 these 2 will be cancelled and here 2 times 1 is 2 2 times 3 is 6 2 times 3 is 6 so this will become 33 so the value of a will become 33 now we will find the value of b so for that we will use this one equation a plus b is equal to 65 so using that equation a plus b is equal to 65 now the value of a is 33 plus b is equal to 65 and here we will move this 33 to the right hand side so this will become negative so b is equal to 65 minus 33 now the final value of b will become b is equal to 5 minus 3 is 2 6 minus 3 is 3 so the value of b will become 32 so our first solution is the value of a is 33 and the value of b is 32 now we will solve the second equation in the second case that is a minus b times a plus b is equal to 5 times 13 so again here we will compare and take equal this expression equal to 5 and this expression equal to 13 so from here we will get two equations a minus b is equal to 5 and a plus b is equal to 13. Now again we will add these two equations to find the value of a. So this minus b and this plus b will be cancelled. a plus a is 2a is equal to 13 plus 5 is 18. Now we will divide both sides by 2. This 2 and this 2 will be cancelled. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 9 is 18. So the value of a will become 9. Now to find the value of b here again we will substitute this value of a in this one equation so this equation is a plus b is equal to 13 so a is 9 plus b is equal to 13 now again we will move this 9 to the right hand side so this will become negative 9 so this will become 13 minus 9 now 13 minus 9 is 4 so the value of b will be 4 now here we get the second solution that is a comma b is equal to the value of a is 9 and the value of b is 4. Now here we will check out and verify that this first solution and the second solution are the exact and correct solution of the above exponential and algebraic math problem or not. So we will verify both the solutions separately. Now first we will verify this one solution and to verify this solution we will write the problem here that is a square minus b square is equal to 65 and here a is 33 and b is 32 so this will become 33 square minus 32 square is equal to 65. Now what is the value of 33 square? The value of 33 square is 1084 minus Now what is the value of 32 square? It is 1024 is equal to 65 So this is 1089 The value of 33 square is 1089 now here we will subtract these two numbers 9 minus 4 is 5 8 minus 2 is 6 and 10 minus 10 is 0 we cannot write 0 in the left hand side of any number is equal to 65 now since both sides are equal so it means that a is equal to 33 and b is equal to 32 is the exact and correct solution of the above exponential math problem now we will refine this one solution. Now again we will write the problem here that is a square minus b square is equal to 
65 and here is 9 b is 4 is equal to 65 and 9 square is 81 minus 4 square is 16 is equal to 65 and 81 minus 16 is 65 is equal to 65 now again both sides are equal so it's mean that a is equal to 9 and b is equal to 4 is the exact and correct solution of the above exponential equation now in last if you like this video so don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel thanks for watching